morning YouTube okay so today I am going to attempt to take my pumpkin seeds which we all know these little bad boys if you roast them they're impossible to eat and I've always wondered how to get them out of the shell well today I'm going to go through a process that I saw on the internet and we'll go ahead and uh, see if we can extract these easily from the shell I just wanted to show you where these came from. This came from one of these pumpkins that I've roasted and it is done. There was a lot of meat in this baby so there's some pumpkin whoopie pies in my future and hopefully a pumpkin pie or two. So let's get started. I've taken them out of the pumpkin and I cleaned most of the flesh off. Get rid of some of this other flesh and I'm going to wash them in a colander. And when I have them washed and back on the sheet, um, we'll go from there. Okay, they are all washed as good as they're going to be. I am going to steal a couple of these seeds, though, to start some plants for next year so I have my own and don't have to buy pumpkins. Um, but these need to be pretty much dry. And I didn't put them on paper towels because they're stick to a paper towel. And you'll be picking them off and having paper towel everywhere. So I put them between... Um, two towels. I'm going to let these dry and then we're going to take a rolling pin and crush these to get the shells cracked and that will help us with the next step of the process. So I'm going to get my water boiling, get the salt in, and get these dry and we'll move on with the next step of the process. Okay, I've reserved my seeds. I saved 10 and I have my seeds still sandwiched between paper towels and what I'm going to do is take my rolling pin and we're going to roll this over the seeds not too hard to crush the seed inside but just enough to crack the shell and then we will go ahead and dump this in water boil them for about 20 to 30 minutes and in theory if this works, ooch. if this works, what we will have is the shells at the top and the seeds at the bottom. And then we can go ahead and um, roast the seeds in the oven. And we'll have pumpkin seeds to eat without the nasty shell on there. So I'm going to get to crushing and I will come back when we have the stuff boiled in the pot. We're in the pot. And we have 20 minutes on the clock. And almost a phone in the pot too. So let that go 20 minutes, said 20, 30 minutes. We'll see what we have at the end of 20. All right, so far 20 minutes has gone by. The timer just went off. And I did turn the gas off and look and there's nothing at the bottom and there's nothing floating at the top. So these suckers are still just rolling around. I'm gonna let these go a little bit longer and we'll see where we are then. It's not looking good. <clears throat> okay, so after 40 minutes, this is what I have. I strained them. None of them broke open. None of them came floating to the top or sunk to the bottom. I don't know. Maybe I just didn't. Well, here's one that's cracked. But that didn't work. The only one that cracked and popped was the one that got stuck underneath the burner. And I don't know. I'm going to throw these in the oven now and see what I get out of them. Maybe once they're dried out, I can roll a rolling pin over them again and see what happens. But so, yeah, that didn't work. So, we're going to go and try something else here and we'll see what happens. Well, this is the final update for the pumpkin seed. I wish I had something better to show you, but. That's what got my pumpkin seeds because the whole process was a big fail. Um, I cracked them like I was supposed to. They didn't separate in the water. They were in for like 40 minutes at a boil and nothing happened except they got soft. So what I ended up doing is I put them in the oven and I thought, well, let me just dry them out and see if, you know, maybe they'll they'll crack or maybe something will happen and I'll be able to get them apart. So I put them in the oven on a sheet tray, 
350 degrees. About 10 minutes later, I hear this popping noise. I'm like, what the heck is that noise? Sound like somebody's making popcorn. They were literally popping in my oven. So when I pulled the tray out, um, there was a bunch of cracks in them. And I thought, well, maybe this is a good thing. So I tried to pick one apart and it just like fell apart. Seed, shell, everything. So that was a big fat fail. So I gave them all the chickens and I kind of dumped them out there for them. And they were all excited. And they looked at them like, what are we supposed to do with this? So I don't even know if they ate them or not, but I hope they did. At least somebody got some use out of them. So I guess I'm back to buying my uh, pumpkin seeds in the store. Unless somebody has another idea, just let me know. All right. Thanks, YouTube. Bye.